Hi guys, in this experiment we are going to see about measurement of zero and negative sequence on three phase alternator. First, the apparatus required are voltmeter 0 to 600 volt, MI quantity 1, and then ammeter 0 to 10 ampere MI and 0 to 2.5 ampere MC each one and then a rheostat 300 ohm bar 2 ampere 2 and one phase variac 230 volt bar 0 to 270 volt 1 the circuit connection for zero sequence is this one here we connect the rheostat and then a voltmeter is connected to a across two line voltages and then this is a variac and then this one is connected to a 230 volt single phase AC supply and then here it is 220 volt DC supply the procedure for zero sequence is connect the armature winding in parallel as per the circuit diagram run the machine at the rated speeds apply 230 volt from variac and measure voltage and current for negative sequence this is a circuit diagram here we connect the voltmeter across any two phases and then we connect here a wattmeter that is 600 volt 10 ampere UPF and then here we connect a ammeter 0 to 10 ampere the field winding is excited by a separate 220 volt DC supply here we connect a rheostat the procedure for negative sequence is run the machine at the rated speed short circuit the two phases of the alternator through a ammeter and the current through the coil and the current coil wattmeter connect the voltage coil of the ammeter and voltmeter between open phases and short circuit phases Gradual, gradually increase the excitation such that the short circuit current does not exceed its rated value and tabulate the readings This one is a tabulation for this experiment. For the model calculation, the formula will be ZL is equal to VL by root 3 by IL and then X2 is equal to root of ZL square minus R2 square. For negative sequence, the value of VL will be 312 and for IF it is 7 and then IA it is 0 0.86 the watt meter reach will show 490 and then R2, R2 is the resistance between any uh, winding that is RYB and then a uh, neutral that is 1.3 for zero sequence that is zero sequence the tabulation will be VL is 230 volt IL is 7.2 then we have to find Z0 here is the calculation for ZL ZL is equal to VL by root 3 by IL take your calc that is VL 312 divided by root 3 
and then uh, answer divided by IL that is IA 0 0.86 0 0.86 the answer will be 209.45 ohm 209.45 for x2 the formula will be x2 is equal to root of xl square minus r2 square zl value this is one taking zl value that is 209.45 square minus r2 that is 1.3 1.3 square root of answer that is 209.44 ohm 209.44 for Z0 the formula will be VL by IA VL is 230 volt by IA is 7.2 ampere 230 volt divided by 7.2 gives 31.9 31.9 let's say experiment is over